Welcome to the HUD Environment Review Online System eTutorial. This video will show you how to complete the Request for Release of Funds and Certification, also known as the ROF or Form 701515 in HEROES. At the completion of your Environment Review, you will submit your Request for Release of Funds through HEROES. HEROES provides electronic versions of the Request for Release of Funds and Certification Form 701515 and authority to use Grant Fund Form 701516. In order to complete Form 701515 in HEROES, all parties who sign this form, including the certifying officer or their designee, must have access to HEROES and the appropriate privileges assigned to them. If your office cannot complete Form 701515 in HEROES, you can fill out a paper copy, scan and upload it into HEROES, and submit it. Use the Upload button at the top of the screen to attach your completed Form 701515 along with your public notice documentation. Once these documents have been uploaded, you may scroll directly to the email notification option at the bottom of the screen without completing Parts 1 through 3. Instructions on routing Form 701515 to HUD and finalizing the environmental review follow in this video. If your office is completing Form 701515 using HEROES, use the following directions to complete this screen. To begin, upload a copy of the public notice demonstrating that the project was published or posted. Only responsible entity users with Prepare 701515 privileges may edit Part 1 of this screen. In Part 1, many of the fields are auto-populated from the initial and project summary screens, but this text can still be edited. Other fields require the user to enter responses now. Ensure all fields are completed and that all information is correct. After completing Part 1, use the Send Notification option at the bottom of the screen to route it to the next user. Enter the individual's email address in the box and a brief message with instructions. You should enter your email address in a carbon copy line to verify the email notification is sent. The system will automatically generate and send the email when you click Send Notifications and display a time and date stamp for your reference. Remember to click Save and Continue at this point to save the changes you made on the form. The automated email will direct signatories to the review within HEROES, where they may review the environmental review record and make certifications on a request for release of funds. There are two certifications on this form. The Certifying Officer line in Part 2 is always required. Additionally, if the recipient of funds is not acting as a responsible entity, an authorized officer representing the recipient must certify the form in Part 3. Users must have the appropriate signed 701515 privileges to complete either of the certifications on this form. In Part 2, the certifying officer, or designee, must complete the environmental certification by first selecting the checkboxes to certify the statements including the applicable box in statement number four. Then enter their name and title and select the date to finalize the certification. Once again, the email notifications can be used to alert the next user. And the save and continue button must be pressed to save information. Part 3 is required where the responsible entity is not the recipient. An authorized officer of the recipient or their designee should certify the review by typing in their name and title and selecting the date. Again, this form can be routed to the next user, and the certification will only be saved by pressing the Save and Continue button. Once the form is complete and certified by all parties, use the email notifications at the bottom of the screen to send the 701515 to HUD or the state agency. At this point, you should click Save and Continue to save the information and exit the review. Following receipt of the 701515 and after appropriate comment period, HUD or the state agency will complete HUD Form 701516 authority to use grant funds to approve the request for release of funds. When the form is complete, HUD or the state agency will send an email notification to alert you that the review has been approved.
At this time, you may finalize the review. Then, on Form 701516, press Continue to proceed to screen 6600. Complete an archive review. To archive the review, select the Archive button, which will post the final environmental review record on the OneCBD website. Standard reviews will be archived for one year, while tiered reviews will be archived for five years. After the review has been archived, select the Finish button. At that point, the status of the review will change from in progress to completed or completed conditioned on mitigation. The review will remain in your HEROES dashboard for future reference. You may continue to make changes to the environmental review record to reflect any updates or new information. If you do so, you should return to screen 6600 and press the Archive button again to update the archived review. For more information on updating a completed review in HEROES, refer to the video on mitigation and reevaluation. Thank you for your participation. This concludes the e-tutorial on completing a request for release of funds and certification process. For additional tutorials or resources, go to the 1CBD Resource Library.